Oh man, it has legit been like a few weeks since I've ridden Darla. Also, legitimately the exact same thing my 90 year old neighbor said about his wife. time on the uh, WR, believe it or not. Why are you stuck on the GoPro? I'm just kind of surprised it's running. And since it's running, I'm like, well, I might as well take advantage of this. So, and it's been doing really well. So, I've just been kind of taking it everywhere. The battery's not so hot on this. So, I've just been letting her sit on the battery tender and let it work itself out naturally. Oh, fuckers. I'm going to get some chicken wings for lunch. That's the other thing. I'm never on the bike anymore except for weekends. So, then I'm like, Wednesday comes around. I'm like, oh, well, I'm out of content now. Shit, what am I gonna do? Well, might as well throw together some 30 second clip of me doing something stupid. Get off the freeway, it's not where you're supposed to walk. Do you guys ever like go to your old MySpace and look at your pictures and be like, what the hell, I used to look like that? Ah, uh, do you, some of you even know what MySpace is, is a better question? Well, the other day I uh, found the login to my MySpace and uh, it's been, oh my God, a very long time. Oh, you're not even gonna see me. It's been a very long time since I have been on uh, MySpace. This truck is freaking me out. Please go straight. Please go straight. Thank God. But there's pictures on there from like 10 years ago. Some, some even older. And it's quite amazing how things have changed in 10 years. That's actually quite a bit of time, but I don't feel like I've changed a whole lot. But when I look at the pictures, 50 pounds is a lot of difference. It's depressing. Super depressing. Like a can crusher. So I found a picture of myself when I was like 50 pounds, li 50 pounds lighter. Yeah, I wasn't 21 yet. And I was taking a picture for uh, my girlfriend at the time. Oh my god. It's. You guys might not stay. Stay in your f***ing lane. No! I'm gonna go over here. Get the hell away from you. You guys might not know this, but I was actually the original, the original one and only scumbag Steve. Here, check this out. This is actually what I looked like when I was 20 years old. <laughs> Funny thing is, I still have that jacket. I do. I, I, I put it on and... I'm not going to show you that picture. <laughs> it's freaking awful. Oh, So uh, I've made the uh, determination that I will start uh, working out. The uh, first step is subscribing to Fitnosity. And uh, I am going to do more active things. And I am going to stop drinking beer. Yeah, there's someone dropped a bunch of crowns out here. Or it's so hot in Texas that Sesame Street's melting. So this WR, guys. This WR is... Not breaking, not breaking. I don't know what to do with it. I don't, because when it's not broken, I like it. I like it, it's a lot of fun, and I can go to Dallas and do hood rat things and just have a blast on it. But once it breaks, man, it's like catastrophic. So I don't, I don't know what to do about it. Let's get it, get it. Oh, a lot easier to get it when you don't hit neutral. Stupid neutral, most useless gear on the street. All right, well, I gotta get back to work, but I also need to check the P.O. box. So uh, I'll be back in a hot minute. And we're back. That was a lot longer than I thought it would be. You might be able to tell by the angle of the sun. Hey, there's a new addition since you last saw me 45 seconds ago. And uh, ooh, I got my Suburban Delinquent sticker finally on my bike. Hell yes. When is that dude gonna hit 100K? Seriously, he's like, been on the verge for a while now. He needs to hit 100K. Has to. Oh yeah, so we're gonna run some errands here. You're coming with me. We're gonna go ahead and check the poo box. We haven't done that in, shoot, I mean, it's approaching a month. So uh, yeah, last time I checked, there wasn't anything in there. And I hadn't actually been promoting it, but I've been putting it in my videos now. So uh, if you see down below, there's a P.O. box if you want to send me things. Send me shit, whatever you want to send me, a letter. It will be open on video. Once I get enough things to open, I will make a video. And I'm gonna make a special one. Yeah. And then we're going to go to Target. Yes, Target, where all the hot milfs go. 
Seriously, have you guys have you guys been to Target lately? Like anytime you go to Target, there's like some sort of like hot mom there. So if you're single and looking for cougars, go to Target, pick up some forks, or some nice bed sheets, whatever they got there. But I am going for a very strange reason. You better not fucking hit me or I will murder you as a ghost. Now you can't ride my ass either, you son of a bitch. Go ahead and back the fuck up. Four foot four. But yes, we are going to target for spoons. Yes, freaking spoons. And you may think that's a strange thing, but if you live in my house, you understand. For some reason, we're always running out of freaking spoons. And no one has the spoons in the room. They're all missing. I, like, two months ago went and bought two dozen spoons. Just spoons, the cheap ones. And we have four left. No one's throwing them away. Everyone plays the idiot. So I have to go buy freaking spoons. Now this time I'm going to be smart. I'm buying color-coded spoons. Everyone gets their own color. Fry riding. Alright, come on guys. One piece of mail, y'all can do better than that. Ah, eat a crotch, you ringity ringity blood. <laughs> Alright, that was my freak out for the day. Oh, I got this wicked shirt. I don't know if you guys saw it on Instagram, but a little while ago I got a really wicked shirt. It was from the Goonies. Now, that, that'll show your age. Well, maybe. Who knows the Goonies? I know the Goonies, but I got a shirt. And uh, I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna try to explain it, but it's, it's, uh, see? This is Texas. Harleys will wave at you. Everyone will wave at you. Because bikers are bikers, and they are all cool. Dude, we can, we're stopping for you. I gotta stop for you. I get a ticket. I got a shirt, it has a picture of a uh, sloth, sloth, and uh, he's got a, it says up there, hey you guys, so my, uh, one of my little kids, she wanted to know what that meant, so I showed her the movie, she thought it was hilarious, and apparently, apparently my sloth impression really tickles her yickle, there's that word again, I don't know why I keep coming up with that, <laughs> neutral, so, if you've seen Goonies, hey you guys, Flippity floppity flippity floppity flippity floppity floppity flippity floppity flippity Oh yes! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! Oh! I forgot to strap my titty strap! Titty strap or double strap? Can't do a stamp or triple stamp? Can't, no. Can't triple stamp or double stamp. You need to brush up my dumb and dumber. Ow! But it's like bombarding my nipples with torture right now. This isn't cool. I gotta... We can do that when we're moving. Skills. Mad skills. Oh, well, I hope you liked it today. Uh, you need to get on the bike more often. I need to get on this bike more often. I, I have more stuff to come, I guarantee you it. But, let's go ahead and flood my mailbox or something. Even if it's just a letter that says Diddy Bingo. I'm okay with that. Rusty P. Coltrane. Ten to four, fat little buddy. Bye.